is the divorce rate over the last 20 years going up or down? Come on. Do you see what I'm saying? But see, we're trying to get in this aspect that this is the way a man should be, and this way a woman should be. No, this is the way they are. Now use it and work with it that way. Does testosterone tell a guy, be nice to the girl? Does he tell the guy, romance the girl? Does he tell the guy, get her flowers? No, he says what? He's always chasing the girl. And that's great because that's what it does to us. See, you want us to be like what? You. But you don't have the same hormones as we do. Sometimes your wife can be just really awesome and then the next following week, you're like, who did I marry? And you think she's a little bit what? Come on guys, you know it's true. But here's what I teach you. Sometimes crazy is just okay. But women don't know that so they think there's something wrong with them because the man tells her she has to be like who? Him. If your husband is not chasing you every day, he's sick. I don't care if he's 30 years old, I don't care if he's 25. And if he's chasing you every day, your husband is not a pervert, he's not disgusting, he's not a pig, he's a what? A real healthy man. You should be thank God for that. And ladies, let me tell you, you're not crazy, you're normal. Ladies, you can cause a man to be deeply in love with you and chase you the rest of your life if you just do those four things. And here's the cool thing on the second part, you also make him healthy. You also make him healthy. Ask my wife. I tell her this all the time. I will text this message to her early in the morning. I'll text it to her in the afternoon. What are the three most important words you can say to a woman? And it's not I love you. Guess what it is? I choose you.